What's good, everybody? It's D Brown Shanghai, and um, I'm sick. I'm very sick right now. I'm miserable. I can't breathe through my nose. I'm tired. So this is gonna be a very short video. We're gonna do this quick before I pass out from sleep exhaustion. See, I'm at sleep deprivation, but I can't even focus because my brain is all is all foggy because of the cold. But anyway, I want to talk about something real quick. So 2K, of course, they're in their campaign. They're in pre-order mode, trying to get people to pre-order a game that we haven't seen. A lick of gameplay from yet which i won't be doing and uh you know i i, I would also say that i'll recommend that you guys you know wait to see if it's worth pre-ordering but at the same time you know don't let content creators influence your decision take the time to inform yourself or whatever i'm talking about like we voting or something their their strategy right now what they're doing to get their pre-order sales up it's kind of weird i'll be honest they haven't shown any gameplay at all but yet they're showing trailers with trey young and lebron and I don't know what they're trying to do. Like right now, I don't understand what, you know, what the objective of these these trailers are. Of course, the objective is to get you to get excited about the game and pre-order. But I don't understand like, like why they're using what they're using, you know? Because seeing Trey Young talk about his come up and everything, while it's all good and it's inspiring, it might be really inspiring for young hoopers who want to be like Trey Young. But for me, somebody who's just waiting to see what y'all gonna do with the game, I don't care about Trey Young. I understand that man get bucket buckets. But at the same time, my nigga, what does he got to do with 2K19? Like, we get it. They're going to know our name, but why? Like, is is this 2K trying to get us to care about the they will know your name thing by putting so much emphasis on it? Because if you were to tell me, somebody came up to me and was like, yo, uh, 2K going to give you a compelling story that you actually going to care about this year? My nigga. <laughs> <laughs> and really how do they get away with this every year them boys don't ever show no gameplay until right before the release of the game like they might do it a few weeks before but they don't ever show no gameplay live already showing gameplay why can't 2k why can't 2k i understand it's different development cycles but still 2k y'all gotta like show something especially if you out here pushing it down people's throat that they need to pre-order your game your game that you know like i said no gameplay uh, the game before it, 2K18, is bad, but you expect us to just blindly pre-order your game, bet. Alright, so my nose is closing and I'm not going to be able to breathe in a few seconds, so I'm going to get up out of here, but I'm going to leave y'all with this. This is a joke that I got from Childish Gambino or Donald Glover's Weirdo, and it, it kind of pertains to the 2K situation. If I can find it, I'll just put that instead of putting me saying it. If you love pizza, and then a dude's like, hey, you like pizza? <laughs> There you go. You're not gonna be like, oh, you asshole. You're like, don't eat the pizza. But basically, 2K is taking something we like or something that we did like, and they're basically making it, they're making it, they're, they're making it bad, you know? It's they're, they're putting 2K in their pants and then trying to make us eat it with all their VC stuff and their, their broken gameplay and they're not updating content. So that last little bit most definitely took the rest of uh, the energy that I have for today. So on that note, I'm gonna wrap this video up. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. That would be dope. And uh, I'm going to go get me some NyQuil. As a matter of fact, I'm going to get lit. I'm going to take me some DayQuil. Where is my DayQuil? Bro, y'all think I'm playing, bro. I'm sick for real, cuz. I'm actually sick out here, man. Pray for me. But I'm D. Brown Shanghai, and I'm up out of here. Always confident, there's nothing that I mentally fear Except giving in to new trends Never look for new friends Cause I don't wanna ride with some loose ends I barely pay a rent but it don't matter They tell me bring a plate but I'ma show up with the platter Here's the ladder to success, better grab it before it's too late I'ma be a multi-million dollar man while you hate Don't ask who's great, I'm in your vicinity, drivers and